What's going on guys, I am with the Moose, and today we have new football outsiders in the game, including this 24-hour hero, Clay Matthews, who is insanely good. I wish I could compare him to his um, Holiday Edition item or Ultimate Freeze item, but I cannot, unfortunately, but he is very, very good. He has the same speed, <clears throat> better zone coverage, he's much better catching as well. Just a fantastic card, no matter what you choose to do with him, you know, you can use him to rush. He has an 88 block shit, which is crazy good. Uh, 94 Pursuit is very, very good as well. Um, just overall a very good card, and the 92 speed and the 95 acceleration are just insane for a linebacker. Very, very nice attributes, and the 71 catching is solid as well. Um, his Holiday Edition item, I think, has like 64 catching or something like that, so it's kind of hard to get picks to them. But the 71 catching really does help him out, and I think I might be picking this card up. It's only going for around 260k right now, and this is only about an hour after the item came out, so... You know, really soon, I should be picking this item up, but hopefully we will pull him in our bundle today. Yes, we do have a bundle. It is an ultimate, or a, a frost bundle, or whatever you want to call it. Not sure exactly what you call it, um, but we do have this frost, the frost packs, and the frost tower pack, along with the large quick sell, which we're going to open in another video, so just hold on and wait for that one. But the frost tower pack, I believe, is just a random elite item. I'm not sure what I can get from this. Maybe I can get collected team of the weeks, stuff like that. I'm just hoping for a good one, maybe at least a road to the playoffs. We'll have to wait and see, but let's try it out right now. Let's see what we get. Hopefully, it is good. What is it going to be? And it's Ladarius Webb, so it could have been worse. He's not really worth a lot, um, but at least it wasn't an 86 overall, you know, the lowest overall you can get. And you got an 87. He's not that great, um, but, I, you know, it's a free elite, and it will be worth a little bit. He is not too bad at all, and uh, probably worth around 15 to 20k, so I can't be too upset about that. Not a horrible pull for me to start it off, but let's start off with the Frost Pack number one. We get uh, a bunch of badges. I think it's three badges. Um, a gold or elite player, a rising star, an 80 overall rising star, and um, a team of the week player. So you really have uh, opportunities for like two gold or better. There's our rising star, Mohamed Sanu. We get an Eddie Royal as our team of the week, and a Danel Ellerby as our gold. We also get a Tundra, and that will do it for this one. So not too bad at all. Got a silver badge, I believe. I think it's three badges. Yeah, silver badge and two bronze badges. Let's open the next Frost Pack, though. See what we're going to get. We got another Tundra. That's always nice to see. Teddy Bridgewater. Could be a backup quarterback, possibly. Mike Adams, gold badge, which is nice. Devonta Freeman, and a Haha -ha Clinton Dix is our rising star, along with another gold badge. So two gold badges, not bad at all. We haven't, you know, had too bad of luck so far, but I like these frost packs. They're pretty nice. Olivier Vernon right there. Uh, most of the uh, rising stars go for around four to six, seven k, something like that. So they're always nice. And we got a Steve Smith Senior right there. There we go, an elite team of the week player. Very nice to see Steve Smith Senior. I'm not really sure how good this card is. <laughs> um, it might not be that that great, uh, 90 speed, 86 elusiveness, 93 catching traffic. You know, it's not too bad, but hopefully somebody needs it for that set. Week 4 offense, I'm not really sure why you'd be completing that now, but hopefully someone will need it. And it's always nice to pull elite cards, and Steve Smith is right there for us. Let's see what else we're going to get. Bronze badge, silver badge, Vince Williams, got a Tundra again. Looks like we're definitely going to be getting a gift soon. Derek Carr, Ronald Leary, Andrew, I'm not even going to try to say that. And a Craig Robertson, it looked like an elite to me, it's not though. And an Alex Smith will end us out for this pack. Alright, a quick interruption in the video. We did actually get another gift from that last pack with a Frozen Tundra. So let's open up the gift and see what we're going to get. Hopefully it's something really good. I still have yet to pull a limited edition. Can we do it now? No, we cannot. We have, I think, four of these now. I actually pulled three of these in, you know, just a late night pack opening that I did by myself. So now I have four of these things. They're badges, if you can see it right in the middle, under the bow, on the little red stripe there. It is a badge, so... Hopefully it's like a five badge pack, but since I have four of them, they're probably going to be one badge packs, and they're not going to be too great. But, you know, we'll have to wait and see until the December 31st and see what we can get. Got a couple bronze badges to start us off there. Everson Griffin, not too bad. Got a gift there, uh, December 29th. It's a badge, not too bad, though. Cordero Patterson is our rising star. Michael Orr is our gold, and that will do it for us. Another gold badge, though. Always nice to see those. Not too bad at all. Got five frost packs left to go. Let's hop right into them. See if we can pull another elite, maybe another team of the week elite. Oh, that was always nice. Malcolm Jenkins starting us off. Got another Derek Carr rising star. And a Mike Evans. There we go. A fantastic team of the week elite to pull for me. He is crazy good. 6'5", 92 speed, 95 release. That's insane. Uh, very, very nice. I'm not sure if I'll be using him on the team. Probably not because I already have a couple big receivers in Keenan Allen and Des Bryant. But uh, Mike Evans is a very, very nice pull for me. Um, should go for a little bit at least. Week, Evan, week 11 offensive set. Very, very nice to see Mike Evans there. And I got another Tundra. So we're getting a bunch of Tundras here. Always nice to see that. And uh, Mike Evans, probably our best pull so far. Very, very nice. He should go for at least 100K, I would assume. Uh, I know he went for a lot when he was, um, you know, in packs originally. Got a Deion Buchanan as our rising star in this pack. Got a Odell Beckham Jr. Team of the Week. Let's go. 
two in a row, 90 overall. Wide receivers, very, very nice pulls for me. I'm getting really lucky. I love these frost packs. They're very nice. Um, they're in the game for about another day here or about 20 hours or so. But Odell Beckham Jr., another great receiver. Obviously, his 24-hour hero is better than this one, but still a nice pull. And he's in the Week 10 offensive set, so hopefully he'll still go for a little bit. Got another gift here. I already have like two of these. They're contracts. Not too bad, though. Always take another gift. And we get a Doug Free, so not a bad Road to the Playoffs pull he here either. Very nice to see that. Got three more packs here, Frost packs. Hopefully we can pull something good from the last three. What are they going to be? We already got a couple nice ones. Got another gift here. Looks like a coin on that little... Um, little ta bag tag there but I'll take it not too bad what else bronze badge got a Ezekiel Ansah which I sold one of those for like 8k a couple days back got a gold badge who else we're we gonna get Zach Bowman and a Eric Reed rising star not too bad at all these packs have been pretty solid so far we have two left hopefully we can clutch something really nice got a Bernard Pierce right there not good ha Clinton Dix ultimate tundra for ultimate freeze tundra another gold badge I'll take it a couple bronze badges and an Alfred Morris to round us out there we have one more frost pack. Can we pull something good? What is it going to be? One more. DJ Fluker starting us off. Got a Tundra right there. Silver badge. Come on. Where's the Elite? Where's the Elite? Not here. D'Angelo Hall. Last card is the team of the week. What's it going to be? Rashad Jennings. So I'd say that's a very good bundle. Pretty good overall. Got a bunch of Tundras, and I'm going to go collect those and get a couple more gifts for you guys. All right, to end of the video, we have one gift pack. Let's see what we're going to get. Hopefully, it's a limited edition. I'm not even sure there are any impacts right now. And we get another contract. So we pulled one of these, and uh, you know we got another one. I think we have four now, so fair enough. Hopefully, it's a, a nice amount of contracts to add to my total. But that will do it for the video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like down below, and let me know what you pulled in your Frost Packs, if you pulled any. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later.